We're given this wave function here, and we're told that the energy is equal to zero, so we can plug that in here, and so this side will equal zero. So once we distribute the Hamiltonian across this wave function, then we should be able to get something like this. The negative uh, h bar uh, squared over the 2m, and then this is going to be a second partial derivative over here um, with respect to position acting on this wave function. And then we can multiply these two, which will give us a plus ux times the psi x. That's supposed to be equal to zero. Naturally, we can put this stuff on the other side, and then we'll plug in these numbers over here. So we'll say that u of x, and then we have the ax e to the negative x squared over l squared is going to be equal to the positive version of this h bar squared over 2m. And then we have the second derivative, um, but that's on ax to the e negative x squared over l squared.